the Western Cape Human Settlements Department plans to claim the back of houses of beneficiaries who do not occupy the houses offered to them. But one beneficiary in the housing project in Eagle Park says, these are all false allegations. Portia Mkansini has more. The Western Cape Human Settlements Department has issued letters to beneficiaries who are believed to be renting out their houses. One of the beneficiaries says people who didn't qualify for the subsidy houses informed the department about the alleged renting of the houses. I'm the oldest beneficiary and I'm telling you I'm not going to lie. They're going with lies to the minister because they're not happy that we are in these houses. These houses are part of a project which was formed in 1999. MEC for Human Settlement says they will take back the houses and give them over to people who are in need of places to stay. <coughs> this elderly woman shared a story with us about one of the beneficiaries who was issued a letter by the MEC, Bongiko Simatikizel. According to her, the beneficiary does stay in her house but is hardly there because of work purposes. There was a black lady staying down there in Sorrow Road. Uh, when they ask her, they say, that they say that her daughter is renting the house down. Her daughter's children is going to school in Belgravia. They leave half past four for a taxi that she can get her children to school. Then she goes to work. And then she comes back home in the evening. I'm very disappointed. We work for this project, man. Poshem Kosini, Cape Town TV News, Eagle Park.